Welcome back to the channel. Today we have the shiny Zamazenta premium figure collection to go along with the Zassian uh, that we opened previously. And exactly the same as that one, we get the promo card, this time with the Zamazenta V, a figure, a pin, uh, 65 sleeves, and 11 booster packs. So we'll get this open. It's almost as tricky as the previous one to open. They've really gone to town with the glue on these. But there we finally have open. Uh, we will have a look at the sleeves, which are exactly the same as the ones we got which I have here exactly the same sleeves this time we get shiny Zamazenta which I have the other one here as well so we can see both side by side I do prefer Zamazenta in general I mean even in shiny form I think these are a lot better than Zassian. Let me know what you guys think, which one's your favorite, if you prefer Zassian or Zamazenta. I also prefer, um, just he doesn't, obviously the other one, Zassian's got the sword in his mouth, which I think that's the bit that I'm not particularly a fan of. I just think that doesn't look as good as the, uh, the main on Zamazenta that looks like a shield. And so we have the packs. And let's see what the pull rates are like in this one compared to the previous one. Right, we start with a rare candy. Bisharp, a Lunatone into an Oddish, Seal, Cricketot, Aron, Riolu, a regular rare uh, or reverse rare Tangrowth uh, into a regular rare Tangrowth. Okay, so second pack. had uh, not too much or not oh, V-Star get out of here we didn't have uh, the best of luck in the previous opening with the Zassian uh, mainly for getting the double Mareep uh, and we got quite a few V's which obviously Galarian Gallery would be the would be the ones you want to hit not particularly V cards from the standard set uh, but we did end up getting a full art trainer for from the Galarian Gallery and we what are we on now the third pack we've had nothing so far we have a grub in though into a scrub Reverse fighting type and a regular rare Zerora. So, pack four. Where did I put? I don't know where I put that first energy. We have another V star. Get out of here. We have a great ball to begin with the Bisharp, a Graveler. Missed out a Scyther almost. Riolu, a Young Goose, Cherubi, and we have Starly, Bidoof, and another regular rare, and a Lycan Rock this time. Okay. So this is, 
this has been bad news so far. This has not been as good. The Zamazenta is my preferred over the Zassian, but the pools in here are non-existent, so I might have to change my mind. Oh, and as I say that, do we get a double? No, we do not. We just get the one, but we do get the Zero Aura V Star from the Galarian Gallery. So, okay, it, the Zamazenta has heard me saying that I'm starting to go off it. And it's produced the goods. It's produced the goods when I needed it. So we have a third V star. Let me get that out of here. We get the lost vacuum. We have the layer on. Yanmar. Come on. We need this box to pick up. And we are we gonna get two? Nope, we're just gonna get a knitted Snorlax on the back. We have a Radiant Eternatus, which is in the regular, in the main set, rather than the Glaring Gallery. Okay, five, five packs left, so we're six down, and we have five left. Two hits so far, and we got seven in the previous one. Uh, six if you count Mareep twice, uh, if you say that's one hit. Uh, I was saying it was six rather than seven for that reason, but I mean technically it was seven. So we have got some way to go to, what do we need one? We're gonna need a hit in every pack and one is gonna have to have two hits, uh, otherwise the Zassian wins. Zassian box wins from the Zamazenta. So we, fingers crossed, Emolga into a Yanmega, and we get a holographic Sky Sealstone. First holographic I've had, um, in out of both collection boxes so far which is crazy really I mean one holographic in almost 20 packs but uh, well, well that's gone luckily it was only an energy we have an ultra ball giraffarig scyther energy search a corefish a aron potion we need a double hitter we get a second tangrowth reverse and a kyoga v okay so th what have we got there three so we need double hitters on both packs and that's just to tie that's just to tie the shiny zassian Come on, let's see what we can get. We have fire energy to begin. Electric into the Ultra Ball, the Giraffe, the Spray, the Seal, the Plant, the Bug thing, the Cat Dog, what is that? Cat or a dog? Cat, cat dog, uh, Mewtwo, nice, Mewtwo reverse, <sighs> into a Zera Aura, so we are down to our final pack, and it's not opened well, so I don't hold out much hope for its contents, if that's uh, an omen, we... Finish strong, come on, Crocorock, Luxio, Friends in Hisui, Purloin, Salandit, a Coffin, Bidoof, come on, 
after this sun curtain. What's it going to give us? Is that a Bidoof? No, it's the Bibarel. And Holographic B. We have Galarian Gallery to end it. So we get the four hits from 11 packs. Let's stick that at the end. We get the Kyoga V from the regular set, the Radiant Eternatus from the regular set, the Bibarel from the Galarian Gallery, and the Zeroora V Star, which is the hit, that's the hit from the out of the two boxes, this is the biggest hit. So not as many hits in this pack or in this um in this box. Also don't forget the promo. Uh but definitely the hit of the two right there. But as always guys, thank you very much for watching and I will catch you in the next video.